Is that not Larry? Shit, I forgot what this motherfucker looks like. Larry! Guys, I forgot what Larry looks like. It's only the second level. How am I already struggling? You, you found, found Larry. Larry! It's a beautiful day, isn't it? I don't want to have to do this. Is there is there another way? Larry, please just talk to me. Tell me. Larry! Oh. Hey yo, what's poppin'? Party people, I'm that one dude, Chris from YouTube, and welcome to Let's Find Larry. This game, my god, this is loud in my ear. Let me turn this down real quick. That gave me a rush. This game is called Let's Find Larry. It was made by Germ Food, the same person who makes, um, I'm getting so fucking distracted. The same person who makes, I, Keep up with them on Twitter. I, you know, follow everything that they've been up to. The development of Night of Consumers Night 2. And then I found out that Drone Food was working on a game within the same style of... Where's Waldo? <laughs> and so this is the product. I don't know if this is supposed to be a horror game. I don't know. Because, I mean, Night of the Consumers isn't really a horror game. But it's like, it can be kind of spooky when the, the customers jump. Without further ado, let's hop right into this shit! My name is Findo! I love finding people, it's fun! Let me introduce you to some of the controls. Go ahead and press A or D on your keyboard. Can you talk a little faster? Oh. Wow, you just made the whole world spin! I feel like I'm gonna hurl! Awesome! That's not awesome, I would like if you don't. Rotating is great for finding a new perspective to look from. Only one more thing. One sec. Uh. Hey, down here. It's me. It must be pretty tough to see me from all the way up there. Right. Mount, press rice mount, rice mouse button to zoom in. Now click me with the left mouse button. We we found Findo. Wow! You're a natural. Well, you're all set to go. I'm gonna go find some people. Please don't harm anybody. <laughs> click on the next big. Click on that big old arrow in the corner and have fun. Okay. This game has, I think it said about 30 plus levels of, uh, let's find Larry. I don't exactly know. What a beautiful day. I went to go something and then I found, and then I saw him. I never forgot his face. My best friend from high school. Larry. He's the talk of the town. I guess because nobody can fucking find him. We haven't seen each other in years. It's great to see you, Larry. You found Larry. <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, I, I wanted to play this. I was going to play Spider-Man, but then I remembered that this came out and I wanted to give it a try. I wanted to see what it was all about. It looks fun. It looks cute. Uh, from what I could tell. Uh... Is that not Larry? Shit, I forgot what this motherfucker looks like. Larry! La Larry! Is this not Larry? That's not Larry. What the fuck does he look like? Guys, I forgot what Larry looks like. This is him, right? It's only the second level. How am I already struggling? You, you found, found Larry. Larry! It's a beautiful day, isn't it? Yeah, it's a wonderful day. Oh shit, it's only the third level. How does the test get this hard on the third level? 
You found Larry. <laughs> You've got mail. Larry! Where are you, you little shit? Larry! Laramie! Found you. You found me. Easy, simple. Can't get any harder than this. Oh, the confetti is... Oh, I was about to say, the confetti is making it kind of difficult. But it doesn't stay. Yeah, I don't know. Like, I wanted to play it. It seems like a, a fun little shut your brain off kind of game. It was either this or Spider-Man. And I know I need to get back to Spider-Man. Because... Oh, there he is. Because it's been a minute since I posted anything. Oh, I forgot he's been saying shit, I think. Oh, good lord. But I will get back to Spider-Man, don't you worry. If any of you are here for Spider-Man, I, I will get back to it. You found Larry. I just wanted to play this simple and easy game. You found Larry. Are you following me? Maybe I am, so what if I am, bitch? Oh boy. See, rest in peace to anybody who doesn't have that 2020 vision like I do. You found Larry. It's only the second level. How am I already struggling? How does the test get this hard on the third level? Am I gonna say anything? No? Wait, who the hell is that in the corner? My mic is it like my mic is sitting directly where the corner of the screen is, and there's somebody popping up in the corner every time I find Larry. Oh. What? Oh. 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 Willie Mac. Oh. Oh. What? Wait, why does it not do it anymore? Whoa, what? I lost Larry. Fuck! Oh. You found Larry. He looks so scared. What the fuck is going on? Wait, who's this? Guys, I don't think this is a cute little turn your brain off kind of game anymore. I don't know. Are they all shaking? Oh, I thought the music cut out. Um... Honestly, not sure what I was expecting from germ food, considering that Night of the Con Night of the Consumers is like kinda out there. But is this Larry? Did I find Larry? Is he just what the fuck? Uh, Larry. See, my problem is that I forget what he looks like, and then I sit and have to look for him for like three hours. Is this not? Who the fuck are you? Can I rotate it all upside down? Maybe he's hidden on the bottom side. Just click. Just click. Got to find him eventually. Oh, there he is. You found Larry. Hey, quit it. My goodness, that took so long. I didn't know that he could hide in the buildings. Oh. Business corporate men. Now I feel like I have to zoom in in every direction. I don't know what happened that last time. Found you, Larry. You found Larry. Stop following me or I'll call the fuzz. No, I don't think I will. Found you. You found Larry. Help! Somebody! Stalker! Hey! It's a party in my pants! You found Larry. Please. What if I don't want to? It's a party in my shorts! 
You found Larry. Nothing could possibly go wrong here. Everything is a-okay. You found Larry. I heard thumping. But everything is okay! Nothing could possibly go wrong here! You found Larry. Oh, oh. <laughs> Have you seen him? Hey, can't you see someone's in here? Okay, I'm sorry. I'm just, I'm looking for my friend Larry. You found Larry. You don't have any idea what you're doing. Are you with them? Oh God, leave me alone. Sorry. Nothing could possibly go wrong. Everything is okay. You found Larry. Oh no! He could be in any one of these cars. No! They're all. Oh, you found Larry. That was easy. You found Larry. I wonder if this is supposed to be telling a story. Oh god. Larry. Can somebody explain to me what the hell is going on? Is there lore behind this? Is this a lore written game? Where the hell are you at? Oh my god. Larry? Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. I can't zoom out. Uh, Larry? I can't zoom out, I can't rotate, I can't click anything. Guys, are you the ones who are bothering my friend Larry? Oh, shit. Listen, I'm on your side. I'm trying to help you out, Larry. I'm trying to do you a favor! Get him off! Oh, it worked. <laughs> Hi. Can I help you? Nobody notices you've been keeping a close eye on somebody. Oh, he said notice. Notice you've been keeping a close eye on somebody. We like finding people too. Recognize this hat? Nice guy Larry once again, the popular local Middlewood resident of being is being honored. The mayor for his several acts of kindness read Okay, so that's Larry. I know he's close. I can smell him. We would like a little word with him. He's a slippery SOB. That means son of a bitch for those for those who didn't know. Proven to be difficult to track down. He's not that difficult to track down. I've been doing it for the past like 20 levels. But you seem to be doing just fine. I'm not somebody you want to be s upset. You want to upset. Stay on his trail. Tail. His trail tail. If you know what's good for you, you'll lead us right to him. <laughs> Larry isn't here.
Pizza for breakfast? That says pizza far breakfast. I need to pee. So do I. I have... I have this. I have this. Graffiti, graffiti, graffiti. Wait, does that say leave this or I have this? Okay, so I may have lied about this being a fun turn your brain off kind of game. I wasn't expecting this. I mean, really, was it a lie if I myself didn't know? I think this is just uh, completely out of left field, totally unexpected. Oh boy. Larry! Larry! Where are you? I'm searching for you, Larry. You can't hide from me forever! <laughs> oh no, my Dead by Daylight is showing. I need to play that again. Oh, I can check the trash cans. Well, that was something that I wish I had known. Ahead of time. Larry! Now that I know I can check the trash cans, you can't hide from me! Okay, maybe you- Larry isn't here. Maybe you can. He's right there! Get him! Excuse me! Ah, oh, that's a, uh, that's a, uh, the, uh, the, uh, the, the... Reference. I get it! I know that one. Larry isn't here. Larry isn't here. Where could he be? Up your ass! And around the corner. Uh-oh. Why do you look like that? You saw them, didn't you? Listen, they, they took my family. They took them. I don't know what they've done. I could be a voice actor. And now they're coming for me. They're relentless. Anywhere I go, they always follow me. They'll never stop. No. No! No, 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 no! There's no escape! I could be a voice actor. Help me, please! I'm gonna die! Ah! Hello? They are here! Please! What am I supposed to do? Ooh. Nope, sorry, I haven't seen anybody. <laughs> Point out where he's hiding. Do it now. Uh uh see I don't wanna I don't wanna rat him out. There he is! Get him! Jump him! He's right here! Uh, What is that over there? I can't zoom out to rotate. Oh, uh, am I supposed to give him up? I believed his story about his family. Uh, there he is! You found Larry. Uh, I did not mean it. <laughs> no. We're at a nightclub in hell? <laughs> this is the kind of music that- Oh, okay, wait, these people are weird. This guy's got a ball gag in his mouth. This music is so fucking intense. Larry, you're in the crowd somewhere. You can't hide from me. Maybe you're not. <laughs> okay, where the fuck is he at? Oh, there he is. You found Larry. Oh my goodness!
This music just makes me want to go to a club and tear that place up. You found Larry. You found Larry. You've got mail. Larry. Larry, I'm sorry. I don't know what they've done to you. Listen, listen, listen. listen. Let's have a heart-to-heart -heart conversation here. Larry, I know what they've done to you. I don't know why, even after you telling me your story and me knowing what they're trying to do, I, I don't know why I'm still looking for you. But I mean, I'm playing a game and this seems to be real life for you. So like, for content purposes, I, I gotta do this. I, I'm sorry. Larry! You found Larry. Larry! Larry! Good job. The fool has ran into a building up ahead. We got him trapped on the rooftop. This is the night, boys. You'll be able to get a nice, clean shot on him from up there. Take this. You found 50 caliber sniper rifle. I don't want it. No, I don't. I don't want it. I don't have my weapons license. Um, especially not my 50 caliber sniper rifle license. I think I left that one at home. Um, <laughs> I'm not allowed to take this. I think if you just, you just give me a back button, we can talk about this for a second. Oh no. Oh no. Larry. Larry, run away. Larry. I don't want to have to do this. Is there is there another way? Larry, please just talk to me. Tell me. Larry. Oh. Larry. It's just ketchup. He's alive. Uh-oh. He's fake. You bastard! <laughs> nice one, kid. I can't shoot him down? Why? You don't know how long we've been after this mother... I feel like that's a little extreme. It's not like I've never sworn before, but for some reason that just felt very... Hey! 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 We got you trapped now! No escape! You've been hiding for long enough. I dedicated half of my life hunting you down. Time's up. Willie Mac! Hey, yo! Cut the shit! Take it off! You son of a bitch! I don't even know what he said. He said something and then this dude cut him off. When I heard the fuzz caught you and put you behind bars, it was their worst, it was the worst day of my life. Cause I thought this moment would never come. The moment where I put you, put a bullet through your skull. That is sick. Um, oh, do I shoot? Should I have taken the shot? <laughs> I can't take the shot. Um, no jump scares, please. Why am I shaking? No jump scares, please. Shoot him! Shoot him! Get him! Can I show this? Am I gonna get? Uh, I'm not even getting paid. Can I? Is this possible to get demonetized? Uh, wow. Do I still have the? No. Larry.
Um. So my question is, where did he get the mask? Is that like, is that an actual mask or did he like... You couldn't just leave me alone, could you? Larry, Larry, it's me, your friend from high school. <laughs> Thought I had a good thing going till you came along and ruined everything. Looks like I need a place to hide. A new place. I wonder if you'll scream as much as he did! <laughs> oh, oh no, 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 no! This is not the kind of game that I wanted to play. No! <laughs> no! Go! Distressing news coming from the quiet town of Middlewood this morning. Where a dismembered body of a man was discovered today in Middlewood Park. The police cordoned off the park and discovered trash bags that had been buried underground. Were those trash bags victims? Trash bags containing severed body parts. Attempts to identify the body have proven difficult, as the authorities state that the face of the man had been removed. Uh... The police are asking for anyone to step forward with any information, or anyone who might have seen or heard anything in Middlewood Park between the hours of 8 a.m. and 9 a.m. That was a very brief window. The extreme graphic nature of this crime bears an uncanny resemblance to the Willie Mack murders that haunted the town for many years. Willie Mack, notorious for the murder and mutilation of 17 people between 1996 and 1999, some of the most graphic of the murders committed in the town of Middlewood. Seven, so you mean to tell me that between 1996 and 1999, three years, 17 people were murdered and mutilated and police still can't find this man? There, there's no way. <laughs> in the year 2001, he was apprehended and sentenced to life in prison. Oh, okay, well, he... So he was found, but then, okay. It's still, it took them two years to find him. Although, only last year, Mr. Mack was presumed <clears throat> dead when a prisoner transport vehicle relocating him crashed and burst into flames. The Middlewood police will be issuing a statement shortly. But for now, we go over to Tom for the weather. Take it away, Tom. Take it away, Tom! I fucking hate this job. <laughs> uh, Tom? Oh, yes! Thank you, Gary. <laughs> it's gonna be a beautiful day, folks! Sunny spells all around! Hey! My man really went. <laughs> I love that. Thank you for playing. No, thank you for making such a great game, Germ Food. I don't think you'll ever see this video. I, I don't know. I mean... Oh, it just closes like that. Okay. That was fun. That was really good. I had a good time with that. I don't know about you guys, but I enjoyed myself. I, my favorite thing about this was how it averted my expectations or subverted, whatever the word is. I legit thought that, you know, maybe germ food was trying to, to get out of their comfort zone and make something friendlier, something a little more fun. And then that first moment where you zoom in and it's like police cars and caution tape. And then you're like, um, you know, maybe it's just, maybe it's just a little bit of a fluke. Maybe my game is bugged. And then the longer that you're looking for Wall, not Waldo, um, the longer that you're looking for Larry and things just get a little bit more sinister. Things get a little creepier. Yeah, I, I should have known from the, from the top because I mean, the fact that, uh, I don't know, <laughs> it was so good. It's kind of, it's kind of, what is his name? Willie Mac, Millie Mac, Willie Mac, right? It's kind of Willie Mac's fault 
for choosing people who have friends. Like, you probably should do a bit of digging into a person's life or maybe stalk them. This is dude, nobody. I shouldn't be giving this kind of advice. <laughs> you should probably check and make sure that they don't have people who would notice that they're gone or notice, you know, their face before you take their face for your own as a way of hiding. I shouldn't be giving that advice. Nobody watching this video take that, please. I don't want to be responsible for anything like that. <laughs> I really enjoyed that though. That was a nice short and fun experience. I cannot wait to see like the kind of updates that this game may get. I can't wait to see if there's like a sequel or something because clearly Willie Mac is still out there. So maybe this game could be, it could be drawn out a little bit more. Maybe there could be a police investigation or something. We could play as a police officer. Because by the end of it, there was a walking scene. Maybe we can go from like looking for clues and then we could search uh, buildings that he may have hidden in for clues and stuff. I don't know. I'm I don't work for the team. <laughs> I'm just the guy that plays the games. But yeah, I enjoyed it. Let me know if you guys did. The like button is down there. Subscribe if you're new. I have this thing in the back of my videos. You can't really see it because I'm always sitting behind. Let me let me show you real quick. This is the milestone headpiece. We decorate and or destroy this at every major milestone on the channel. First uh, first milestone is 500 subscribers. And subscribe to the channel if you'd like. If you wanted to see me play Resident Evil, I have a video linked somewhere in this video. If you wanted to see me play Night of the Consumers, that was a really fun one. I, a lot of people really enjoyed that one. That is also linked somewhere here. I'm gonna get out of here. I love you guys. Stay safe out there, especially if your name is Willie Mac. They're coming for you. They will find you. You can't get away for very long. Take it easy and big buddy out.